Glenn Campbell may have died after 60 years of making music, recording until well after the onset of Alzheimer's, but for many people his career boils down to a handful of singles, recorded in a scant few years at the tail end of the 1960s and the start of the 1970s, particularly the three Jimmy Webb songs he had huge hits with By the Time I Get to Phoenix, Wichita Lineman and Galveston. Country singer Glenn Campbell dies at 81 Read more but what songs? They are the anchor of his canon. But you would certainly add Rhinestone Cowboy, written by Larry Weiss, John Hartford's Gentle on My Mind, plus a couple of lesser web songs, Honey Come Back and Where's the Playground Susie. After that it's down to personal taste. He was, really, the perfect artist for the greatest hits album. For the collection that allowed you to cut through the schmaltz and sentiment to the artistry. Campbell was canny enough to know that the town cycle was his ticket to greatness. He reunited with Webb repeatedly down the years. In 1974 he released Reunion, the songs of Jimmy Webb, with Webb himself playing piano. Webb was the orchestra conductor on the 1977 Royal Festival Hall show that was released as a live album, and whose track listing provides a telling insight into Campbell's Musical Mind, with show tunes, rock and roll standards, Jacques Brel numbers and Beach Boys songs, alongside the pop country hits. In 1988 Webb supplied eight songs to the Light Years album, and that year the pair recorded a live duo performance that was finally released on CD in 2012. Facebook Twitter, Pinterest, but let's go back to the town cycle, because those are the three songs most people will be returning to when they hear the news he has died, not least because they're songs that ache with loss. Webb's writing is peerless, of course, he never bettered these three songs, but they wouldn't be half so good without Campbell's delivery, because he wasn't yet an established part of the more firmament, he could still convince as an everyman, and these were very much the songs of an everyman, filled with wistfulness, regret and the truest of all emotions, but the one least frequently expressed in love songs, ambivalence. By the time I get to Phoenix is a staggering achievement for both Webb and Campbell, Webb had written a song about a man whose actions are, in any accounting, poor to the point of awfulness. He has left his partner in the worst possible way. He's pinned up a note and walked out, and then driven, east along the freeways, to Phoenix, Albuquerque, Oklahoma. He knows she be calling until the phone rings off the wall. He knows she'll be crying herself to sleep. He just doesn't care, or not enough, as far as he's concerned he tried. To tell her he didn't love her, she just never listened.